Hi, I'm Angus at LabVac. Uh, sometimes after you've serviced a pump, or even with a new pump, you can find that uh, you don't get a very good vacuum. Um, this is often because of something called priming. When new oil is put into the pump, it's important that the mechanism inside actually picks up the oil from the sump and gets it right the way through the oilways inside the pump. And sometimes after servicing or transit, you can get uh, air blocks inside the oilways that prevent the oil from flowing through the pump and that's the reason that you don't get a good vacuum. So what I'm going to demonstrate now is something called forced priming. What this does is to increase the oil pressure just for a brief period to force out any air locks and make sure that you've got oil flowing right through. What you should see then is that the pressure will drop and you'll be back to having a good pump. So in a moment I'm going to switch the pump on and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to cover the exhaust port just loosely with my hand, which is why I'm wearing a glove, and I'm going to, with the other hand, just release the valve, the gauge that's sitting on top here, just to let some air in so that I can build up that pressure. And what you'll also see is that the oil level here in the sight glass will drop considerably, probably about an inch, inch and a half from when you start the pump up to after it's fully primed. And what's happening there is the oil's travelling through the pump, so a lot of oil gets picked up into the mechanism, so the level in the sump will drop. So here we go. And there's the pump now, dropping down to the correct working pressure. Thanks for watching.